fourth and final effort. Well, you've got two heats of the hurdles, and of course, Tiffany Ophelia Porter goes in the next heat. She's the fastest on paper. There's the lineup for heat one. Mamona of Portugal, Tominska of Poland, Dechereva of Russia, Caravelli of Italy, Janowska of the Ukraine, and Tuverson of Sweden on the outside. Well, certainly the fastest athlete in this heat is Tatiana Dechereva of Russia. That's the Ukrainian. Yanovska, Dektoreva has run 12.68 last year. She's got away to a very modest start this season, at only 13.23, and that's why she's been seeded in this heat. Another interesting athlete goes in lane three, Karolina Tominska, wearing the red and white for Poland on the far side. Very well known to our own Jess Ennis. Normally a multi-eventer, heptathlete, and uh, this season she's actually cut her best hurdles time down from 13.54 to 13.39 and important for her because that would mean a whole heap of extra points in the heptathlon she's the only woman in the world who can live with jess ennis over the last event of the heptathlon the 800 meters she's pretty quick she's run two minutes five seconds or thereabouts so that's pretty good but in comparison to afili 12.77 this year in the 100 meter hurdles the fastest woman in this field this season is Caravelli of Italy at 13.12. She's in lane five. Set. Good start there by pretty much all of them. Tominska is away well, but now Dechereva is moving. And so is Caravelli of Italy. Caravelli and Dechereva coming away. The Russians just edging it at the moment. It's going to be very close. Dechereva gets it. Caravelli in second. I think Tominska in third place. 13.16. So that's pretty much uh, a season's best there for the Russian. Not quite sure about the wind, I think just into a slight headwind there. But uh, nothing really to bother Tiffany or Philly Porter about there, Steve, I don't think. Well, hopefully not. Wind was uh, just minus, well, minus one meter exactly, actually. Dekureva performing a little better, still nowhere near the sort of performances she was producing last year, so I'm not quite sure why she's not. Um, running quicker than this, but 31-6 good enough to win that first race.